Hello everybody and welcome to Uprising 144K, I'm Hydrogen Man. So before I begin guys, I'm not giving you any medical advice, I'm not making any medical claims. I am showing you what I do and what I'm doing today is I'm creating a solution with povidone iodine and distilled water that I use only sometimes. In my opinion, you don't want to do it all the time because it actually could lower your immune system just because of the way that it kills you know, good and bad bacteria for example in the mouth and in the throat but let me go ahead and show you what i'm doing now i will also say if you're pregnant or if you have thyroid issues i don't know if i would do this there is an alternative there's a few of them one you can use uh, food grade hydrogen peroxide make sure to do the proper levels because otherwise you can harm yourself and also apparently you can use uh, salt water but i'm using povidone iodine today and what i'm using is a 10 percent povidone iodine keep in a cool dark dry place and then what i'm doing in order to get the right ratio is this is a four ounce bottle and to four ounces of distilled water i would need to put 1.2 teaspoons of povidone iodine i ended up putting a little less than the four ounces so that way i ended up using one teaspoon of povidone iodine just so that i have this mixture and basically what i do is i pour a very small amount into a cup and I swish it first in my mouth. You don't want to gargle first. You want to swish it in your mouth first for 30 seconds, really, really, really hard, and then you spit it out. Then you get another very small amount. I mean, I'm, I'm talking small, like I'm not using much, just very small amounts. And then you gargle with it. While you're gargling, yes, you do it for 30 seconds, and try to say the vowels, A, E, I, O. You, as you're making these different sounds, it opens up different areas within the throat where different pathogens can quote unquote hide that you want to try to get to and it would be the same protocol if you were to do some type of salt water kind of flush like this if you were to do that but that's how I made my 0.5 percent solution of the povidone iodine with distilled water for my mouthwash and gargle and that's it guys I only use it when I feel that I've been in contact with someone or something that would be possibly dangerous for me. I'm, I'm not going to say what it is here on video. If you're in a place where you think there's a lot of sick, sick people, if you're a nurse in a hospital where a lot of people are sick, um, all sorts of different scenarios. I did it today just because I thought I was around certain people that might have been sick. So this is what I'm, I'm doing at this time. And tonight, after all this, I will be doing a nasal flush, like with the neti pot. And I'll be using just my distilled water, a little saline, and very small amount of food grade hydrogen peroxide it will be a ratio of 0.1 percent that i'll be using on that today later on and that's it guys so i hope that you found this information helpful don't forget to support the channel don't forget to subscribe and don't forget to look for me on rumble you can look for me on rumble under the hydrogen man all separate words the hydrogen man i'll also try to put some links below so you can find me there and that's it guys thanks for watching and oh you can also find me on getter g-e-t-t-r that is just an app similar to twitter and i'm over there i'll be sharing some information here in the near future also so thanks for watching guys and i'll see you next time on the next one